Hi, I'm Danny, and in this video, I want to show you how you can make musical fruit using a Makey Makey and Scratch. Let's take a look. So if you've not seen one before, the Makey Makey is kind of a bare bones circuit board with six inputs that you can connect to crocodile clips and then you can put things on the end of those crocodile clips. So basically it mimics almost like a, a Game Boy Nintendo controller in that you've got up, down, left and right, then the space bar and then the left click. If you connect things to the crocodile clips you can then mimic uh, the up, down, left, right keys being pressed or a space bar or the left mouse click. So if you use those inputs in a program like Scratch you can then use that to control your Scratch program. So I've got my crocodile clips plugged into the Makey Makey, up, down, left, right, space, and also a white one to be the earth. These are then connected to the fruit and veg that I've got. I'm using paper clips to make it easier to get a connection. So I've poked a paper clip into the veg and connected my crocodile clip to that. But you can click straight to the veg if you want to. So in my drum kit version of this, I've basically used a scratch program that uses the events to look for when particular keys are pressed, so you see down here when space key is pressed I can drag that down and you can change that to up, down, left, right or whatever. So that's the command I've used up here for when up arrow is pressed and then particular sounds. I've then used the sound commands down here, start sound and then choose the sound I want it to play. So I've got up, down, left, right and space so when I click the flag I can then go up In another version of this, I'm using the music blocks. So to get those, go down to the bottom left corner of Scratch onto this little blue square down here and choose music. That will add um, some music components. When the flag is clicked, set an instrument, particular type, so I've used uh, synth, and then play note um, for each of the, the notes that make up the Close Encounters theme tune. So it should go up, down, left, right, space, So it's pretty easy to get started with this. Basically anything you put on the ends of the crocodile clips become a controller. You need things that are conductive. So uh, fruit and veg work really well. I've used metal spoons, uh, cutlery, tin foil, play-doh. Things like plasticine won't work because they're not conductive. It needs to be something that's conductive. I'll put a guide to this on the blog with some screenshots and some instructions on how to do this and I'll put some links to the projects on Scratch if you want to play with a ready-made program just to get started. Thanks for watching, hope you found that useful. Do check out the blog, do check out the rest of the channel. Please like and subscribe if you, if you like this kind of thing and I'll see you again soon with another new video. Thanks for watching, bye bye.